we've heard stories of people like Rob Peace before, and they never get any easier. An exceptionally smart black man with a knack for science, a hardworking mom who encouraged his study, and a father who encouraged his sense of community. Rob broke free from his poor New Jersey background and into Yale, where he graduated with honors. But it was his efforts to give back to the people of his neighborhood that would push Rob to the breaking point and into the life of crime he had largely avoided until he was gunned down, murdered at the young age of 30. These details aren't a secret, and Chiwetel Ejiofor's moving, powerful drama Rob Peace isn't trying to hide them. Based on the book by Rob's friend and college roommate, Jeff Hobbs, the film takes a sensitive approach to what could have been cliche material. But it's clear that Ejiofor has admiration for Rob Peace, something close to awe, at the man's brilliance and dedication to family and friends. He was ultimately a flawed, tragic hero, but his story feels like it deserves to be told on the big screen. And that's something you can't say about every biopic out there, especially those that find their way into the Sundance lineup, as this one did. Edgy of Four has put together an amazing cast of big names, starting with himself as Rob Peace's father, a small-time criminal and beloved local figure who was sent to prison for a crime he may or may not have committed. Rob gets his sense of community from his father, but in his conviction, Rob also learns that the world is a chaotic, unfair place in need of control. Mary J. Blige plays Rob's mother, Jackie, who wants more for her son than their New Jersey neighborhood can offer. Pop star and Cinderella actress Camilla Cabello plays Rob's first serious girlfriend, Naya, who is swept up by his charm, brains, and gregarious personality. But for all of those big names, it's newcomer Jay Will who impresses most. As Rob Peace, he delivers a true breakout performance, outshining everyone around him and carrying much of the emotional weight. It's a complicated role, as Rob endures a lot in a short period and Jay has to switch gears often. Rob puts it upon himself to work on his father's case, securing lawyers, money, and more with the rigors of a college that always seemed to be looking for a way to get rid of him. Meanwhile, Rob is always moving among different circles, making friends in the white community who can help him or his father's case, setting things up for the future, while staying true to himself. It's a demanding role, and Will knocks it out of the park. Ejiofor's obvious regard for Rob Peace is a double-edged sword, though. He has a tendency to romanticize and gloss over his missteps. Rob's relationship with Naya is disappointing because Cabell has proven herself a strong actress, but the film has more than enough on its plate without a love story. Blige is solid, even if her role demands she be more reserved than we'd like her to be. It's Edgy of Four and Will who really cook when on screen together, as a father challenging his son to be better and a son struggling to meet the impossibly high expectations. Even if Ejiofor's Rob Peace looks at its subject with rose-tinted glasses, there's something to be said about a film that wants to honor and cherish this unique black soul, this brilliant black man, this tragic fallen black hero. Ejiofor sets out to capture Rob's full story and to make him more than just another stereotype, and he has succeeded. Rob Peace is in theaters now, and it gets a 3.5 out of 5. Thanks for checking out the show. If you like what we're laying down, please subscribe to our channel and click the bell to receive notifications for all of our latest stuff.